Hi to all my newbies in Blender. We're going to create a texture for our character or we're going to assign a texture to a character. I made the textures in Substance Painter and now I'm going to apply them to, uh, to the geometry. So first off, I'm gonna go to object mode and I'm going to select the um, object that I wanna apply the material to. Then you're gonna go down here on the right to material properties it has a pre-signed material. We don't need it, so we can just delete that, and we're gonna make a new one. So after we've created the new, and you see it comes up right there, we're going to make sure we have the Node Wrangler. So if you go to Edit, and then Preferences, and then Add-ons, then you can search here, Node, and make sure that Node Wrangler is checked off. Uh, if you don't have it checked, please check it and then refresh, and that should get you all ready to go. Um, after that, we can go over to our, um, not UV editing, we're gonna go to shading. Shading is where we will apply the textures. So you'll see you have your nodes down here. You're gonna uh, select this principal uh, BSDF, and you're going to go, select on your keyboard, control shift T, and that will bring up a file menu. Uh, you're gonna go to your file that has your textures and find the textures that you're trying to apply. So I'm doing the t-shirt. So I'm gonna go to my t-shirt textures and I have them labeled here. So I'm just gonna select all the PNGs relating to my shirt. Um, mm -hmm. I think that's all of them, the PNGs that is. Okay, and then if I apply like I just did, they'll come up right off the bat immediately, just like that. And I can go back to modeling. And if you can't see it in your uh, viewport, you might not have the same selection as I do over here, the same shading. So if you go up to the top, right you can click that and you can see your material all set and it's really easy and great because everything gets applied all you know the roughness the specular um your normals and stuff all the maps get applied that fast so that is how you uh, create your textures and apply your maps in blender and you would just do that for each different texture that you need all right thanks guys i'll see you in my next video